Welcome back to Ivy's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how I make my stuffed mushrooms. What I like about this dish is you can either eat it as a meal or you can serve it as an appetizer at a party. If you're interested in seeing how I make my version, keep on watching. For the complete recipe, please check out ivyskitchen.net. You want to start off by cleaning your mushrooms. I don't like seeing any brown spots on my mushroom, so I like to take a damp paper towel and rub it around the mushroom so I can peel the top layer of the mushroom skin as shown. You will be cleaning the mushroom stems the same way. Chop the end of the stem and discard. Finally, chop your mushroom stems into small, pieces. You will need to remove the gills inside of the mushroom. You can do this by taking a spoon and gently scooping it out. Make sure not to break the mushroom cap wall. If you have a smaller mushroom and a spoon doesn't fit, you can use the end of the spoon to scrape out the gills. Chop your scallions into finely small pieces. You also want to mince and chop your garlic. Wash and finely chop your parsley. In a bowl, Add your olive oil and marsala wine and mix. We are going to marinate the mushroom caps in this marinade mixture. Remove the Italian sausage from the casing and discard the casing. Chop your bacon into small pieces. Add oil to a pan and add the bacon and sausage. You want to cook this until it is brown. Once the meat mixture has browned, you want to add the mushroom stems and mix. When the stems start to brown, add your garlic and green onions and mix. Add your panko breadcrumbs and combine it evenly with the other ingredients. Add your mascarpone cheese and continue cooking until the cheese has melted and the sausage mixture is creamy. We then want to add the Parmesan cheese and parsley. Go ahead and season this mixture with salt and pepper according to your taste. Preheat your oven to 325 and start stuffing your mushrooms. For the recipe and instructions, please check out ivyskitchen.net. Bake until the stuffing is browned and crusty. Enjoy! Thank you for watching Ivy's Kitchen. Please don't forget to subscribe. For the complete recipe, please check out ivyskitchen.net. Until next time, happy cooking!